Back in the early 15th century, a wealthy Frenchman and a royal librarian for King Louis XIV, Melchizedek Thevenot, noticed that in order for a bubble to stay in the center inside of a tube of water, the tube must be placed on an exactly horizontal surface. And this later on led to the invention for our tool what we use today, the spirit level or the bubble level. So what is a spirit level or a bubble level? It is a tool used for determining the horizontal and the vertical levels. And sometimes it comes with a lot of different sizes and designs. Like for example, what we have here. This is an example of a spirit level or a bubble level. Most designs has only two tubes or vials. One is for determining the horizontal level and the second one is determining the vertical level. But sometimes the third tube or vial is added. And these are used for the angular surfaces, or specifically, the 45-degree plane surface. So even though spirit levels differ from sizes and designs, it has the same fundamental parts. First is the vial. The vial has two parallel lines and located at the center. Inside the vial is a liquid, which is commonly alcohol or the similar liquids, and also an air bubble that is used to indicate whether you are at the horizontal level or at the vertical level. And these are all enclosed inside a metal or wooden case. Now that you know a brief orientation about the spirit level, let's go and demonstrate how to use it. So what I am doing now is I am reattaching an old shelf. And using a spirit bar, I am putting it on top of the shelf to make sure it is balanced horizontally while I am attaching the shelf. Using a marker, I am putting a spot where I am going to put the screws. Using the pointing tip of the screws, I'll use a slight force to anchor it to the wall. Now I am putting back the shelf and I am finally putting the screws while the spirit level is on top. Every now and then I am checking at the spirit level if it is horizontal. If it is not, then I'll make a few adjustments. Now I am finished. At the center. And that is how you use a spirit level. And that's all for today.